Um, are you interested in doing any kind of like web development using Rust as the front end code? Um, it's absolutely possible. And in fact, uh, it's been something that I've been working on recently, which is creating a brand new course that will get you started uh, with u.rs. So u.rs, as this uh, website is showing, is a front end uh, web framework. Uh, think something like React, um, or as it says also, Elm. Uh, basically, we can code 100% Rust. Uh, let's uh, sort of like take a quick peek and you know take a look at what this might look like. So, in our um, in my live.rs, which is kind of like an app.js for a React app or a Vue app, uh, we have a functional component um, and uh, we have whatever Rust code we want. We are even using a centralized store, think similar to Redux. And then we have our HTML and uh, can actually just deploy this out and uh, everybody can see it. In the end, uh, this over the you know over this course we have two sections of it. First, we have really small, tightly focused uh, lessons on like how do you, for example, create a button? How do you how do you do like this very specific thing? It's a very short videos, uh, and they're in sections, and it should be uh, easy to sort of follow through or skip them if you've already seen them or already know. And then at the, at the end, we have a project. So in this case, this is the to-do project. Um, I have, let's go ahead and log in. Um, I have a, a, a Docker a container running a, a database. I have that all scripted up and you can actually pull this repo down and get a to-do server uh, running. So you don't need to worry about any of that. You can just write the front end code that's gonna consume this API and uh, save, um, save load, uh, basically all the CRUD actions for all the tasks. And uh, basically all the things you'd expect to be able to do in a to-do app, we can do here. So once again, uh, this is an introduction to u.rs. If you're already advanced at URS, it's probably not the right course for you. But if you've never done any web development before and you want to sort of check it out, you want to get started with that, this is perfect for you. So with that, hopefully I'll see you in there. The entire course is for free on YouTube. Um, and in fact, it's in this playlist. Thank you so much for watching and uh, I will see you in that course. Bye.